Hello and welcome to the Jazz Inspires YouTube channel. I hope you are safe and well. My name is Joe and in today's video I will be reviewing an album named The Adventures of Astral Pirates by American jazz fusion drummer Lenny White. This album was released via the Elektra record label in 1978 and it has continued to be a favourite of many jazz enthusiasts for decades. For this album, Lenny White collaborates with an amazing group of musicians that includes Alex Blake on bass, Don Blackman on organ, piano and vocals, Nick Morocco on lead guitar and Jeff Sigmund on rhythm guitar. Each member of the band brings a unique sound and skill set to the album, creating a truly exceptional fusion of jazz, rock and funk that is both experimental and fresh. The first track on the album named Prelude Theme for Astral Pirates sets the tone for the rest of the album with its spacey electronic sounds, haunting piano chords and layered electronic string sounds. The track almost blends seamlessly into the second track Pursuit, which is a high-paced and thrilling fusion of jazz, rock and funk. With a nimble, tight drum beat, funky bass line and some gracious guitar chords, this track features some amazing moments from the guitar that instantly throw you into a wild musical journey. During the final third of the track, dreamy vocals join the mix, helping to begin your journey into the unknown astral territories. The third track on the album, Mandarin Warlords, starts with an Eastern themed sound that relates to the name nicely. The intensity continues to build with a mixture of gong strikes and drum rolls from Lenny White, along with electric guitar licks. The track eventually drops into full swing with lovely vocals from Don Blackman, accompanied by a toe-tapping drum beat and juicy guitar lines. At this point, you have fully taken flight and have now begun your astral journey through outer space. On this track, I particularly enjoyed the electric piano solo that begins about halfway through. It's fantastic. A bit later in the track, there is also a stunning electric guitar solo. Mandarin Warlords is full of excitement and energy that will leave you wanting more. Next up is a track named Great Pyramid, which has a much funkier edge than the previous tracks. The bass line from Alex Blake sounds really groovy and the pace on this track has reduced from the earlier tracks. An Egyptian synthesizer melody enters along with some growling guitar chords. This track is short, but it has a really engaging sound that will keep you interested. The fifth track is named Universal Love, and it instantly has your head nodding from the infectious piano chords at the beginning of the track. Eventually, guitar strumming begins before a crispy drum beat and the inspiring vocals of Don Blackman kick in. Moreover, I have to say that Don Blackman provides the shining moments on this track. The way he navigates the ever-changing rhythms and groove with his vocals is impressive. This track feels experimental from both a musical fusion standpoint but also a vocal standpoint, and it works. I really enjoyed this track a lot. Track number six named Remembering symbolizes everything that is cool about this album. As experimental as the record is, time is taken here to recognize the jazz roots that have contributed to the new and fresh merging of sounds that we hear on this album. This 30 second straight ahead jazz snippet is lively and nostalgic. It is a tip of the hat to the classic, recognisable jazz sound that has influenced this album's music. The next track on the album, Revelation Astral Pirates, is a highlight of the record. It starts off ethereal and dreamy, featuring electronic string chords and then some wonderful electric guitar soloing. Then, just after the halfway point, we hear some solo jazz piano playing that adds an unexpected burst of euphoria to the track. 
The music has a very optimistic and uplifting vibe, and it's all about the emotion and feeling you get while listening. This track is not necessarily supposed to feel like a well-structured, formulated track, but more like a journey that takes you to different emotional landscapes. Stew, Cabbage and Galactic Beans is another track that stands out on the album. From the outset, it has a heavy, rock-inspired feeling to it that will electrify your senses. The organ used in this track complements the sound of the electric guitar perfectly, and the dynamic bass playing from Blake and Lenny White's incredible drum rolls are other highlights. This electrifying track is packed full of energy and showcases the band's skillful and tight musicianship. Heavy Metal Monster continues the rock-heavy sound as the band showcases just how wide-ranging the sound of jazz rock fusion can span. Again, an organ is used in this track, but it seems to have a distortion effect on it, which sounds great within this far-out musical landscape. Lenny White and Alex Blake provide a great rhythm for the other musical elements to really shine making this track an exhilarating listening experience. Assault is a fitting name for the next track, as it's a high-paced, simple number that is a pure assault on the senses. This track provides Lenny White with an opportunity to wow the listener with incredible drum soloing, which is honestly something to behold. Outside of White's impressive solo, the track doesn't have as much musical complexity as the other tracks on the album, but it is exciting nonetheless and will keep you on the edge of your seat. The final track on the album, Climax Theme for Astral Pirates, is named appropriately as it provides a climactic ending to the album. It shares some elements with the first track on the record, but it's a much more beefed up version with extra layers of sounds. As the track progresses, it really comes into its own with some amazing electric guitar, piano and drumming moments. The collage of bright sounds, smooth chords and funky bass line are a wonderful mix and it's a classy ending to an album that crosses multiple genres with minimal friction. In conclusion, The Adventures of Astral Pirates is an album that blends different genres in a really good way. It's an album that showcases the band's incredible musicianship and ability to create a unique and captivating soundscape. If you're looking for an opportunity to widen your jazz or rock horizons, this is the perfect album to check out. I highly recommend it to anyone who loves music that is both adventurous and exploratory. So don't miss out and make sure to check this album out. That brings us to the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed my review of Lenny White Presents The Adventures of Astral Pirates. If you did, one of the best ways you can show your appreciation is to subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out a lot. Thank you again for stopping by. I hope to see you again real soon. All the best.